hood, hood, rich, hood, rich, hood, rich, hood, rich, hood, rich, hood, rich, 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 you know, I'm in the Bronx, but today we in Manhattan with it. It might be Harlem, might be, I think it's Manhattan, all right? We gonna just take a little stroll downtown, man, and see what's going on, man. Teens arrested after smoke shop fight slash Midtown Manhattan NYC. This just happened, right? Let's get into it, man. I got a feeling it's gonna be a goodie. So we gonna watch this together, my boys. I hope y'all doing well, man. Spark some, man. Get lit with me. Let's go. This for everybody who be saying they miss New York City. And they want to just see what's going on in New York City. No, you don't, my nigga. It's wicked out here, my boy. This police is locking everybody up, my nigga. I'm telling you. Y'all know how it is, nigga. If you been here, you from here, you know how it is. Even if you gone. You know, nigga. You here for a little bit. You like, let me get the fuck up out of here, nigga. This police stripping. But all right, let's go. That's corny, bro. That's some hypocrite shit. I don't like that, bro. Respect me as a man. I don't like that shit. I never like that shit. All right, so right now, as you can see, these two gentlemen, the young two niggas right here, man, yellow hoodie, red hoodie, they on the sideline probably being held, questioned, like, oh, what happened? What happened? Ah, ah. Just so you know what's going on. Let's go. Nigga said, why you got your hand on your gun? Police be doing that shit, though. I don't like it either, my nigga. None of us like it. But little nigga, you know. That ain't the first time you seen the police when they're around you, nigga, with their hand on their gun, nigga. At least that shit ain't out in your face, because police be pulling that shit out in your face real quick for no reason. But I see what he mean. But you starting some shit, nigga, because you know. Why do you have your hand on your firearm? Why are you rushing your hand there? Why is there somewhere to rush your hand? No, no, no. Come on, bro. I don't yeah, like I that, bro. Like, what's going on with you? You feel, you feel all of a sudden? You said you feel wrong? Like, what, bro? It doesn't make no sense, bro. You know what you got to tell the police? When they start gripping their they hand, man, you're not even doing nothing. You being calm? Like, bro, it's no reason to fear for your life. It's no reason to fear for your life. Because that's what they're going to say. When they body your ass, when they smoke your ass for no reason... They're going to say, I fear for my life. You got to let them know there's no reason to fear for your life. I'm chilling. I'm just, I'm saying. I'm still alive. I don't know what happened. They could check my pocket since you're looking so hard, bro. All I got is my wallet, bro. They probably didn't even search these niggas yet. Yeah, they probably didn't even search these niggas yet. He definitely got his hand on his gun because they didn't even search these niggas yet, bro. Yeah, all that. Bro, I'm just saying, bro. Like, what's going on? 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 Like, what's why you just have a standing? That's Police do stay doing that. Police will be like, all right, get out of here. We leave you alone. Walk away and we leave you alone. Then you get up the block. They start following you. Hey, come here. Like, nigga, you just said, get out of here. You're going to leave me alone. Now you talk about, hey, come here. Nigga, now I'm, get the light feet going. Get the light, the light. I'm out of here, nigga. Fuck out of here. I don't respect y'all shit. And I never will ever again. I don't respect y'all shit. I never will. I just got shit. I got on. A little nigga. My little nigga. My little nigga in the yellow turned up. That nigga ready to go to jail tonight. Guess who's going to jail tonight? Guess who's going to jail tonight? Definitely the nigga in the yellow hoodie. The way he talking, the way that boy talking, nigga, he want to go. He want to go. Nigga, they thirsty. They thirsty. Are you ratting? Hold up, nigga. You snitching? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up, nigga. Hold up, nigga. Hold up, nigga. I ain't even know that. Is you telling? Hold up. Because I'm pretty sure they got the other group of niggas who was fighting detained somewhere else. And now y'all niggas telling the story. Hold up. How we telling before we even got to the motherfucking precinct? 
Niggas tell them before they hit the preset. Hold up. Let me see. Before I, before I accuse them. Let's watch. It was two of them niggas. What? What? It was two white. What's two niggas white? Yo, this nigga ain't even hit puberty yet. You hear this nigga voice, bro? This nigga did not hit puberty yet. This nigga voice is mad young. Nike, good Nike tech on. Good Nike tech on. He said he sat there and explained everything that happened to them and they act like they understood. So you told the whole story already, nigga. <laughs> Why these little niggas want to be bad as hell? And they locking them up after telling the story. Nigga, you just told for nothing. Nigga, you just told for nothing. Yes, they're all going. Guys, who's going to jail tonight? I knew it, bro. I told you. Nigga, them little niggas should have ran and not got caught, nigga. You run till you caught, nigga. You run till you caught. <laughs> Yeah, they on your ass now. They got extra cars out. I'm 17, bro. You was just saying, as a man, I don't respect it. As a man, I don't respect y'all. I don't fuck with y'all. You were just saying that, little nigga. I mean, I fuck with you. I'm on your side, little nigga. I ain't on the police side. I'm on your side. But... You was just saying all that. Now you talk about how you 17, nigga. What that got to do with the equation? Huh? The math ain't mathing, nigga. You was just broke. I, I was, as a man, I don't use all that. All that energy. Remember, I was telling you, I was fucking with the little nigga in the mustard. But I told you he was going to jail because I could tell by the temperature. They don't care about your earbuds, nigga. Don't cry, nigga. Don't cry, nigga. They always ask that. <laughs> they always, you already think sharp that can poke me? Yeah, nigga. The fuck? I do. Well, not right now, but yeah, nigga, typically. Why am I being detained? Why am I being detained? You could tell this little nigga, nigga, he don't heard somebody else tell him that. Like, yo, when they lock you up, when they grab you up, nigga, ask him why you being detained, nigga. They gonna let you go. No, this is New York City, nigga. You know that. These police don't give a fuck about none of them rules, nigga. None of that. They not gonna, nigga, they gonna ignore you every step of the way, nigga. Lock your black ass up, search you, take you to jail, nigga, all that. You know that. You know how it go. I done been a victim of this shit many times, nigga. I'm glad this ain't me, nigga. I'm, just, I'm glad I can react to this shit and it ain't me getting fucked with them because, nigga, I done been through this shit enough. Y'all niggas gave statements already. Y'all niggas gave statements on the street. They don't give a fuck. Bro, I told y'all the story about the time when I fought with the... I got, I got it shaking with the police, nigga. They put them cuffs on my shit so tight, nigga. I had scars on my wrist for months, nigga. They don't give a fuck about how t tight them cuffs is, nigga. They did that shit on purpose. For talking shit. You shouldn't have been talking shit. That's that Cat Williams. Hey, guys, where they locking you up? Bro, bro, what the fuck? Yo, bro, they locking me in the shop for nothing, bro. I got a hop. I got a hop. I sat there and I got, I got a bat down on. I got a bat down on. These little niggas, right? I ain't gonna lie. Niggas, I got back down on with a bat. Like, nigga, he telling the whole story. Nigga, he ain't forgetting nothing. Keep going, niggas. What else? What else happened? Now, don't put him in the car too quick. Let him keep talking. What else happened, my nigga, with the yellow? The other nigga, 
The other nigga voice too soft. The other nigga ain't even hit puberty yet. The other nigga voice too soft. I can't even hear what he's saying, nigga. Let the nigga with the yellow talk. Nigga, the nigga with some bass in his voice. Let him talk. Then you go, you got Officer Dickhead with the bald in the middle. You got Officer Dickhead balding in the middle. You see your man's little balding dip already, you know what I'm saying? Listen, man, he's stressed. He, he don't like his job either, nigga. He, I don't, some of these police, my nigga, they really don't like their job either. So they take it out on us. You know what I'm saying? They pretty much, that's pretty much what's happening. Y'all niggas still giving statements? Why the door open? Oh, it's over. It's over. Who this? Who are you? What you talking about? You telling? Sure, yeah. Hey guys, uh, I saw two guys getting arrested. Anything right. you guys know about the arrest and what's going on? Um, yeah. so basically, right? Shut the fuck up. So basically, right? Um. Ha 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 ha! Whoa, 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 whoa! Why she do Richard, Richard, fat boy Richard, like Richard, that? Richard, Richard. God damn, why she do fat boy like that, nigga? Just cause my nigga like to eat all the beans, greens, nigga, all the all the motherfucking pig feet, all the hog mog. Just cause my nigga like to eat all that. Why she look at him? Look, look, look how she did, homeboy. Look, look. My nigga try to talk. Look. So two guys getting arrested. Anything you guys know about the arrest and what's going on? Um, yeah. So basically, right? Shut the fuck up. So basically, ha! right? Ha! Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Yo, I ain't even know this video was going to be this good coming into this shit. Yo, I see this fat boy like that. Um, my friend went in the store to buy weed. And he was going to sell it to us. And we're minors. Which store is this? Yo! Whoa! Right, bro. Bro. They ratting like a motherfucker in this video. Nigga. The niggas was ratting. Then the, bro, let's keep going, bro. This young lady, this shit look like an innocent young lady. You know what? She look like a, nah, the way she told that nigga shut the fuck up. No, she not. No, she not. She snitching. It's the, it's it's the, the smoke order. shop all oh, the way down smoke there. Shop. It's a smoke shop. Okay. Go ahead, give them the address. Yeah, they're uh, for sale legally? Yes, for sale. I don't know. They don't didn't know. ask. Well, they sell it to minors, so it's They sell it to minors. They don't even ask for your she age. Just start, give it to you. She started off with, they, we tried to, we went in there, they selling weed to minors, so she a minor. Uh, you know what? We're going to... She's going to give her a pass because she says she's a minor. And then what you going to call it? We're going over there to buy weed, right? So it's not a legal decision? I don't even think it's legal. So they could ask for to check for ID. Because they think there's only like three legal uh, marijuana dispensers. Right. Yeah. So basically, right, uh, they thought he stole something. Nigga, did she tell you shut the fuck up? Oh, I guess she letting you speak now. I guess since she got her shit off, she said what she had to say. Now she gonna let you get your shit off, fat boy. Go ahead, fat boy. Now you free to speak, nigga. And he didn't take anything, actually. They saw him beat him up in front, beat him up in the store. They beat him like it's two of them. And uh, mind you, huh? it was a gro it was two grown men that beat up a thirteen year old. The that store was owners. Yeah. You know the one that had, that with the bread tech. Oh, they say he was stealing. Got beat up by them, and it ended up getting. Yeah, they say he was stealing. Basically. Basically, so the little niggas was in the smoke shop stealing, or allegedly, allegedly, the little niggas was in the smoke shop stealing, and the smoke shop owners got on their ass and beat their ass. I want to hear this story. Let's go. Who is Richard? 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 I don't understand how that makes sense, but I guess he's 13, got beat up by them. I'm and over that here guy trying to the, deli, he the, guys from the, the guy tried to assault him because the guy in the deli right next to the smoke shop, literally, what you call it? He had a bat that had nails in it and he yeah. was gonna hit us with it. He was chasing Ooh, us. He actually it. tried to swing it at them, yeah. And they had and they had to step back. Why do you think he did that? Because he thought that. I guess he was scared for his life or something like that, because he just jumped a 13-year-old. You feel me? There's like it's like I think it was like six or seven of us in front of the stool. He, he thought that he stole some weed or something? No, he, no, he they stole thought he candy, candy. A like dollar it. candy. So he, so he jumped him. Wow. And I don't think he, he's never been in that store before. And like, for me, they just jumped him. Uh, I, he comes Did they hit him with the bat? Oh, I got jumped, I got jumped. Did they hit him with the bat with the spikes, nigga? Walked down there. And I'm like, what happened? I walk in the store, I see him. I was like, yo, what happened? Why you jumped him? Da -da -da -da. He was like, get the fuck out of the store. This out of the third. Mind you, I wasn't hostile. I was just trying to talk, right? They called the police, right? 
and I'm guessing they said that he assaulted them or something like that. He didn't touch them. I don't think, I don't believe he touched them because he's they small. They just beat him up. All right. So, all right, man. Listen, as you can see, dog, little niggas got their ass beat. It sound like, man, niggas was stealing some shit or the store owners thought they were stealing some shit. And so they pursued to beat the little niggas' ass, man. Somehow the little niggas got locked up. Clearly, I don't know, man. They said it's on camera, though. They said the whole thing on camera, so I don't know, man. But look, this is a night in New York, my nigga. This is, this right here, you know what I'm saying? It's just another night in New York, my nigga. Another night in New York. I I happened to see the video on my TL, on my timeline, and reacted to it. You know what I'm saying? So I hope y'all enjoyed it, man. Jimmy Gang, subscribe to the channel. Like the video, man. I drop daily over here. Two, three times a day sometimes, man. I know I'm probably the hardest working new nigga on YouTube, bro. I've been grinding it out for like a year, my nigga. I'm not, I gotta be hardest working nigga at least. One of the hardest working. Jimmy Gang, I'm gone. I'll see y'all in the next one, man. Let me know if y'all rock with the video in the comments. I'm gone. Bye. Have a beautiful time.